What's poppin' Rob Television? Welcome back to another reaction with your boy. As you can see by the title, man, I decided to finally come with a Dominique Wilkins reaction video. Now, he's been a pretty requested guy, but I've never really had the chance to get a hold to him because y'all been requesting Bird, and I've been going real crazy with the Bird videos, but he's most definitely been requested. This video just popped up on my timeline, and I've never really seen the slam dunk you know, between Michael Jordan and Dominique Wilkins. So I was like, man, why not react to it? But you know how we do over here, man. I ain't gonna talk y'all to deal. Before we get into this video, man, make sure you don't forget to smash that thumbs up button. Also, if you're new to the channel, man, make sure you subscribe. And if you're watching my videos consistently and you haven't already, make sure you subscribe. When you subscribe, turn on that post notification bell. You know about all things Rob Television. Let's check it out. Jordan, Dominique Wilkins. And I ask you fellas, you uh, if I can you thought Nathan. Jordan should let him go first or not? Well, I think that uh, Jordan probably did the right thing. He's going to put the pressure on Wilkins. And Dominique is going to give a little running start to this one. You see some. Much, though. <laughs> From high okay. above the rim. High above the rim. Well out in front. I think that that's the key. As well as the height, how far out in front he caught it when he's able to hammer it home. And again, he makes it look like it's routine, but watch, look how far away he is. That's a great start for Dominique. And look, still going up when he, he caught it. Right, and he stayed up for so long, took off from just inside the bottom of that circle, and was able to throw it He was up there, though, I ain't gonna lie, he was up there. He tossed it up from the top of the key, but watch one more time. There he is from the top of the key, the perfect toss, the perfect timing, and look at he stay up, up, and throws it through with power. And the perfect score of 50 on that There you go. Your Aaron is now the defending champion. Well, now Jordan does have his first taste of pressure in the slam dunk competition. <laughs> I'm predicting a 50 on that. <laughs> yeah, that's hard not to give him 50 on that one, Steve. That was impressive. That time he did that's the two hand double 50. clutch. That's 50 words. He did look like the kiss the rim type of dunk he done before. He got a 50. Well, we're still even as Jordan goes up and takes it way down and then hammers it home over the top. And you'll see from way up high just how difficult it is. And we'll see the Dominique Wilkins reaction. He looks like a heavyweight fighter who's just taken a roundhouse right. And now he's going to set to throw another one. So that's the second 50 of the day for Michael Jordan. But remember, the, the scores from previous rounds don't advance. This is the championship. Dominique Wilkins and Michael Jordan. Ooh. That rattled like, the floor. Like uh, 45 being shot someplace, that one exploded at the bottom of the net. That man, that thing sounded like a shotgun. Boy, he caught that thing, man. He has more power than any dunker that I've seen play this game with the creativity also going along with it. Here he comes up in the air. Look at the legs. Look Man. at the, arms, the windmill and power. He almost lost it. Let's check the judges out after he hit that one. Ooh, they were impressed enough to give him a... Hey, that's what gets you points to a lot in a lot of them dunk contests is the power you put behind them dunks. Not just the dunk itself, but the power. There is a dunk that thing sounds like a shotgun, man. So that's two straight fifties, bro. Get some heat on him now. We're gonna we're gonna see what the gut judges will do now. I see some Mike got the pressure on you, man. That's two straight fifties, dog. Jordan for his second, out of fifty on the first. Oh, look what's going through his mind. He said, You know the greats, though, they perform well under pressure. championship crowd you know and they are trading big heavy right punches Jordan took a long time to think about this knowing he had to get the judges attention 47, oh, 47 was awarded on that dunk oh that is some great creativity and you notice he's going they with gave the him 47 a little more power as we watch the reaction of Dominique Wilkins as Michael went in for the dunk 
and he just waits to see what the score is. What y'all think about that dunk? Y'all think that was 47? He takes off. Look at the way he moves the ball from the right down low to the left, two hands, and throws it through with authority. These judges are going to need the National Guard to get out of Chicago Stadium. It's but then it's in Chicago. Oh my God! Well, Dominique only needs to come up with a. Well, no wonder they going so crazy. If he gets a forty-nine or a forty-eight, forty-nine, he can't lose or 40, 48. Oh, that was I guarantee you, he will not get fifty on this dunk. Guarantee nah, he not gonna get fifty on that one because it was almost like the last dunk he just did. Judges are going through their entire. Are flashing in front of their eyes. 47. Michael gets a 50, and it's a dunk off. <laughs> well, we, want, we watch Dominique Wilkins come in and again with a power and authority low with two hands. And the judges have awarded yes. Dominique Wilkins a 45. That's incredible. <laughs> Could we call it a make good? I mean, that's a two hand window with authority from the sideline. But in all honesty, though, the dunk he did just do previously was a one-handed windmill. And the same thing, he bounced back and did a two-handed windmill the next dunk. So, I mean, I get the power, and, you know, I get the trying to mix it up, but, I mean, it was basically the same dunk just with, you know, with two hands. So, damn, 45, though? Here he comes, I understand that. Up, down, I mean, because they gave Michael, what was that, a 47 for the dunk he did, and that was, you know, more credit than a, a double-handed windmill. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. 49 to win. Hey, you don't think the crowd has some influence on the judges on that last dunk? Hey. <laughs> well, they're on their feet. If I was Wilkins, that would have been my car that I went to. Here's another guy that relishes the channel and then pressure. But again, creativity and imagination is the key. Plus, he's got to make the dunk. He needs a 48 to tie. A 49 to win. The defending slam dunk champion, Michael Jordan. If he were to win this, he'd be the only two-time winner in the four-year slam dunk competition. Larry Nance won it. Dominique, Spud Webb, Jordan, and Michael is backing up. Oh, so Jordan won two dunk contests? Middle of the backcourt. Now he's got big hands. Man, he made that ball like a tennis ball, bro. A soccer ball or something. Well, the crowd lets you know what they think of it. Now Iconic, we man. Wait for the judges. A 48 ties. A 49 wins. Michael Jordan scored 50. He defends his championship. And he took off further inside than he did the last time, but it's still a spectacular dunk. And certainly deserving of a high score that he received, Steve. But Dominique Wilkins got the short end of a very impressive dunk. Consistent judging all day until the last two dunks prior to this. The 47 and the 45. A note was passed down to the judges. <laughs> <laughs> this Iconic is dunk, man. <laughs> all right, you guys, that's it for the video. If you did enjoy the video, do me a big, big, big favor, man. Smash that thumbs up button. Also, if you're new to the channel and or you watch my videos and you haven't already, what you doing, man? Make sure you subscribe. When you subscribe. Click the post notification bell to be notified on all things Rob Television. And I will see y'all in the next reaction video. I'm out this thing. Gang, gang.